Hello. Hello, Jennifer. Hi, Hello. Hello. Hello, no, hello. I think it's, uh, hello, Catherine. Hello, Lorena. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello Margarita, hello. Griselda, Jacqueline, Carla, Kremlin. Papa, hello. Hello. teacher, uh, ayer no pude estar en la clase, pero hija. Don't worry, Margarita, because I couldn't. I, I couldn't either. Ya la estábamos okay. sufriendo de nuevo. No <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't worry, Margarita, don't worry. I can see Ingrid over here. Rebecca. Okay. Good evening. Good evening, Ingrid. No, Carla, Vanessa, Juan Antonio. Good evening. Well, hello, hello, Carla. Good evening. Well, I hope tonight we're not gonna face we're not we're not gonna face any trouble, right? Yesterday was was the exception. But tonight, uh, you know, no, I, I think everything will be all right. It is not raining over here. Everything is okay, so hopefully we're going to have a great time together once again. Hello, Jacqueline. Good evening. Jacqueline. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Hey, now, uh, well, yesterday we started with the class, but we couldn't finish, right? So it was, it was a, a bad day. But today, tonight, it's, it's better, right? It's a, it, it seems to be an a, a time in which we can learn a lot. So, Catherine, tell me about something new you've learned lately. Let me. What is new in English, Catherine? Let me. Mm -hmm. Se me han quedado algunas como, como voy a decir corbata que es blouse que es blusa o scarf que es bufanda. Okay, so increasing vocabulary. Thank you, Catherine. What about you, eh, Lorena? Yes. Hello, Hi. good evening. What's new in English? Yes. Hello, what's Perdón? new? What is new in English? What is ah. new in English? <clears throat> ¿Qué es lo que he aprendido? Is... Yeah, that is right. What have you yes. learned lately? Description of person. Description of person. Uh, now I have, I have a student, a leader, a good... Hmm. About? Hello, hello, what happened? Lorena. Oh, hola, hola. Okay. Creo que lo puse. Okay. Yeah. Este, now I have studied a leader, a bot possessive de adjetivos, um, possessivos pronoms, y, y las iniciales de mi nombre. Okay. So possessive uh, pronouns. Which are the possessive pronouns, Lorena? Hola. Uh, what are the possessive pronouns? Uh, I still new to study. Uh, se me dificulta un poco decirlo en inglés. <laughs> okay, practice because I will get back. Okay, practice, Lorena. Okay, okay yes. Rebe. Okay, Rebecca, what's new, Rebecca, in English? What's new in English? Well, um, I practice uh, the positive adjective. Um, wait a minute, please. Um, y cómo usar um, un poco más a detalle el el artículo a an da okay so, uh, do you have it más. do you have some examples Rebecca you want to share with the group okay um bueno ese lo en español porque <laughs> eh, 
por ejemplo, para, para poder ocupar el, el artículo A, que es cuando estamos eh, aplicándolo a, a algo que comienza, o por lo menos fonéticamente, con una palabra, una consonante. Okay. Y cuando ocupamos eh, an, es porque eh, fonéticamente o escritamente comienza con una eh, vocal. Ok. Ok, thank you. No, it's, okay. it's okay. It's okay, Rebeca. El da o di eh, tiene, tiene varias reglas de cómo aplicarse, pero, eh, pero, pero eh, generalmente es cuando es algo eh, definido, ¿verdad? algo definido que, para poderlo explicar o señalar. So, ok. Okay, thank you very much. Well, I will ask two people more that we're gonna we're gonna uh, start with the class. Actually, uh, I'm uh, presenting the same information I tried to present yesterday. Josué Artiga, what's new in English? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh, I was practicing uh, some questions about interview questions for example introduce yourself how do you see yourself in five years and something and something like that okay okay later on you can you can sh uh, share the information with with everybody like uh the way you see in five years ahead <laughs> okay you can share the info later. In five okay? years, I... Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay Jose, it's, it's okay, okay. Uh, Jose, <laughs> Angel, Angel, what's new in English? Angel, can you listen to me? Jose, Jose Angel. Well, no. Hello. Eh, perdón. En ese momento estaba hablando sobre los objetivos eh, posesivos y los pronombres. ¿verdad? Exactly. Entonces yo tenía ahí como un poco de dificultad porque eh, me había confundido de que sabemos que los, eh, los adjetivos posesivos es como decir... Eh, tú, mi, este, estamos hablando de, de uno, ¿verdad? Yo, y los, y los pronombres serían tuyos o de ellos. Uh, Mío, well, tuyo. Well, we have like different, different forms of possession. Okay, so for example, we can talk about possessive adjectives, my my car, my book, my laptop, your car, your book, your laptop, his car, his book, his laptop, etc. Right? So and also there are some possessive uh, pronouns such as this laptop is mine, this laptop is yours, this laptop is hers is his etc right so but don't worry lorena i know i know your point okay sometimes it, it seems to be like confusing but the only thing we need to do is to put everything into practice okay and actually tomorrow we're going to talk about possessions okay tomorrow tonight i will try to develop the class i started with yesterday because you know yesterday was it was um very difficult it was impossible for me to to go over the topic. So I consider it's important to see the information orderly and with no technical problems because yesterday I suffered from technical problems. But fortunately tonight um, I'm in better conditions. Okay, let us finish with Goretti. Goretti, what's new in English? Um, the clothing. Um... Nothing. Uh -huh, clothing, um, yeah. the, the scar, um, uh, um, 
Ah, no me acuerdo cómo se llama. Scar era falda, ¿verdad? Pero bufanda y, y, y falda las confundo. Ah, don't worry, because we're going to go over it once again. Well, people, mm -hmm. we took like seven minutes to see what's new in English. Now, if you want, if, if, if there is anybody else who wants to, to share something with the group, that would be fantastic. Okay. Si hay alguien más que quiere presentar algo nuevo que hayan aprendido, perfecto, y luego vamos a la clase. Excelente. Juan Antonio, go ahead. Eso me gusta. Que tengan algo nuevo que compartir. Ok, Juan Antonio. Good evening, teacher. The topic is description of person. Es mi hija, voy a hablar de mi hija. Excellent. Now, now take your opportunity. Okay. Uh, I have a daughter. His name is Catherine. K A T H A R I N E. And she is very little. She has long hair. His eyes are black and she is eight years old uh, currently studying second grade only teacher fantastic Juan Antonio there is only one observation okay only one observation okay. cuando hablamos de una de una señorita de una niña decimos hair hair su cabello okay. hair hair sus ojos hair eyes Okay, etc. But we say here, si es para un varón, decimos his. Okay, but no se preocupen, mañana vamos con ese tema, pero okay. lo quiero dejar claro desde ahora. Carla, Carla Vanessa, ah, go okay. ahead. Thank you, Juan Antonio. That was fantastic. Eh, no, por error. Eh, ah, okay, so. Okay, now, uh, let's see. Jennifer wants to participate. Jennifer Paula, go ahead. Yo lo que he aprendido es cómo utilizar la, las reglas eh, de terceras personas. Eh, cómo ponerle, por ejemplo, el donde va el, el que le ponen la S al final, la ES, cuando termina en go, que se le pone la S, y cuando la, las, personas, la, las palabras terminan en Y, este se le ese se le cambia y se le agrega la i y se le agrega el, el, el es también okay. y en que cuando vamos a utilizar el, el do y el, el no da y el dase eso es lo que yo he aprendido fantastic hey somehow that's going to help you a lot thank you Jennifer Paola Margarita hello uh... Hello. How do you say palabras in English? In words. 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 Okay. And I learned uh, the short words. Um, she will. Um, trying. Uh, calling. I. Uh, uh, I participate or I practice in Duolingo. <laughs> Es eh, eh, sobre, how do you say it? Sobre. Over. Over and colors blue, eh, the blue shirt or blue pants. And eh, solamente. Okay, very good. I, I really like to see that your, uh, your enthusiasm is, you know, important, right? Ese entusiasmo que muestran es sumamente importante que no lo pierdan. Otra cosa es que cuando pida su participación, tratemos de hacerlo en inglés. Aunque sea poquito o mucho, o pues lo que produzcan, pero que sea en inglés. Ok, so we're going to start with the class. Ok, now fortunately, well, now we are more than ready and we are willing to go over the activities that I, I had prepared Uh, from yesterday, right? So we started with the topic about clothing. We discovered um, that there, there is a lot of vocabulary. There are many in English. And of course, well, 
uh, we're gonna try to go over the videos and about the links that I shared with you yesterday. So now we have a lot of work to do. Okay, now we started with this video yesterday, right? So we're gonna go over it and I hope that you could listen to me yesterday. Well, we were like practicing the way to pronounce, or, or we were like, like defining, right? Like different categories about clothes. And we this call, we started with um, clothes that we wear uh, for work and clothes that we wear for leisure time at home. Okay, and we said people, now let me remember about the vocabulary, please. What is he wearing? What is he wearing? Shirt. Ah, shirt. it's a shirt. shirt. It's a shirt, right? What else is he wearing? What else is he wearing? Tie. Tie. He is wearing a tie. What else is he wearing? Bill. 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 No. What else is he wearing? Jacket. 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 Okay. And jacket and pants are? Pants. No. Jacket and, jacket and pants, pants are? Suit. 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 Right? Suit. Suit. Now, the, I will learn a different way to say like, like pants in English. Do you remember? Pants. No, but yesterday, well, we saw a different one. We're gonna see a different one tonight. What else? What shoes. else? Shoes. shoes, right? Shoes. Shoes. Okay, now shoes. shoes. We also uh, studied about. Question. Tell me. Oh. Um. Uh, tell the plural shoes and singular. Shoe. Shoe. Yeah. Shoes. Shoe, so be careful, right? Because be, if it is, it is like a shoe, somebody may say, Blessed, you, right? Oh. But I say, a shoe. Yeah, bless you. Plural, yeah. And <laughs> shoes is plural, right? Okay. Yeah, no, that, that was a joke, right? So, but this is singular and that's plural. And then we have a raincoat and we have dress. And then, how do you say tacones in English? High heels. High heels, High heels. right? High, High heels. heels. Very oh. good. Now, we have this vocabulary. And what is the category? What is the category, people? Clothes for work. Clothes for oh. work. On oh. the other hand, we mm -hmm. have... Clothes for work. Clothes for... for leisure. Now, leisure. what's the meaning of the word leisure? Leisure. 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 What is Leisure. it? Leisure. Uh, exactly. Thank you, Catherine. You're very Come kind, on. right? Leisure. So, Come listen. On. Yeah, the point is, uh, what I want you to learn is, lo que quiero que, que, se, ah, que se acostumbren es que cada palabrita importa. Mm -hmm. Que cada palabra importa. Entonces, si encontramos algo que no sabemos, hay que buscarlo. Okay, mm -hmm. so and over here we have hat, 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 We also have t-shirt, 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 jeans, Boots, gloves, gloves. Uh, do you remember about this? Pajama. Pajamas, right? Pajamas. Pajama. And this one? Swimsuits. Swimsuits. Now Swim we're gonna suits. yeah we're gonna see the presentation the guy um has the information he has and we're going to pay special attention and if it is possible to to repeat uh, once again hi everyone in this class you'll learn clothes vocabulary particularly clothes oops, oops, oops sorry 
clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Clothes for work. Clothes for work. Tie. Tie. Belt. 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 Jacket. 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 Pants. Coat. 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 Shoes. 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 Blouse. Blouse. Scarf. 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 Skirt, high heels, high heels, raincoat, raincoat, dress, dress, clothes for leisure, clothes for leisure, sweater, sweater, jeans, jeans, gloves, gloves, boots, cap, boot, t-shirt, cap, t-shirt, shirt, socks. Socks, sneakers, sneakers, pajamas, 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 pajamas. Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. I would like for you to talk about the clothes that you wear for work and the clothes that you wear for leisure. If the clothes are not mentioned here, you should add them. For example, where is the word that I where we learned yesterday? Tie right? for work. I wear a tie for work. I hate that. I wear shirts. Shorts. I at home. At home. Shirt at home. The word work. After you do this, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay. So well, actually, that was the part of the video we uh, we started with yesterday. And also, I presented more vocabulary over here, right? And I, I, I know that you have been practicing. So we're going to do a something a little different, right? Uh, since yesterday, I shared the link. So that means that you were, that you put, put into practice, oops, the vocabulary, right? So let me see. Now we're gonna do the opposite. Yesterday we talked about about clothes and we we learned vocabulary. Now I want I want you to tell me the way to pronounce the word and then we're gonna listen to it. Okay. Como, como sé que ya, ya estuvieron practicando, entonces primero lo van a decir ustedes y vamos a ver cómo lo dice él. Okay, él o ella. Okay, so the first one. Sure. Sure. Uh, okay. Sure. Now, now listen to him. Shut. Okay. Sure. Sure. Very good. So you were practicing. Shirt. Ya veo que sí practicaron. Veamos la segunda. Jacket. 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 Now listen at the very beginning of the word. Jacket. Okay. The, does the jacket. person say jacket, jacket. Ja or jacket? Jacket. Jacket. Jacket, 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 right? Jacket. So there is a slight difference, but it's important to mention it. Now, this one? Trousers. Trousers. Excellent. Now, there are some people who are pronouncing the S at the end. Let us listen to the person and let us notice if he pronounces the S. Trousers. Trousers. ¿Sí la pronuncia? Pronuncia la S al final? Yes. Sí, ¿verdad? Trousers. Okay. Listen. Trousers. Trousers. Now, this one? Trousers. Ah. Jumper. 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 Cut. Cut. Okay. Oh. This one? Jam. 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 Excellent. Let us go over it a little bit fast. This one. Sweatshirt. Is it sweet or sweet? Sweatshirt. Sweatshirt. Okay, so it is sweatshirt. 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 Okay, sweatshirt. Sweatshirt. 
Huge and, uh, trip. Yeah, now there is something that you need to learn because, you know, I am an English teacher, right? Teacher. <laughs> but this is T-shirt. T-shirt. T-shirt, right? T-shirt. T-shirt. All right. And this one? Polo shirt. Polo t-shirt. Polo shirt. Polo shirt or polo t-shirt. Sweet. Sweet. No, no, no. This is not sweet. Suit. Suit. No. Suit. 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 Okay. Let us repeat then. Let us repeat this one. Hoodie. Hoodie. Dress. Blouse. 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 Skirt. 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 Boxers. 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 Cap. 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 Gloves. 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 Scarf. 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 Cut. Hat. 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 Broad. Bra. 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 Underwear. 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 Boots. Boots. Shoes. 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 Slippers. 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 Flip flops. Flip flops. Flip flops. Flip flops. Sneakers. 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 Tie. 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 And bow tie. Bow tie. And bow tie. Bow tie. Very good. No. Bow tie. Let's see. Well. Uh, as I said before, yesterday we started to categorize the clothing, right? We have men's clothing. Men's clothing. Men's clothing. We have unisex clothes. Unisex clothes. And we also have women's clothing. Women's clothing. Women's clothing, right? So we have different, different, um, items on here okay so i hope that you have studied this info okay how do you pronounce this shirt 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 trousers boots boots i am Overalls. Overalls. Uh, Overalls. Uh, Bad row. Bad Very good. Now, I can see that you're like uh, pronouncing quite well. Winter clothing. Winter clothing. Summer clothing. Okay, so we also have some some items, right? So jewelry, handbag. This is for ladies, right? Panties, a ring, lipstick, and more among others, okay? So, tell me the name of this item. Jacket. 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 All right, tell me the name of this item. Shirt. 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 Tell me the name of this. Shoes. Shoes. Uh, these are shoes. This one? T-shirt, polo, 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 polo T-shirt. That's a polo shirt, right? A polo T-shirt. Bra. 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 Hat. 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 Gloves. 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 Uh? Gloves. 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 Trousers. Trousers. Trousers, right? Tie. 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 Scarf. 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 Coat. Coat. Okay, that's a coat, right? That's a coat. Oops, oops. Uh, there's only one over here, right? So in this one? These are boxes, right? So you have more over here, right? So I hope that you have like practiced a lot, okay? Because we need to move on to the next part. Now, coming back to the platform, coming back to the platform, okay? 
Now that we know, now that we, we have just get familiarized with some vocabulary about clothes, we, we're going to see the information in this conversation. Hey, call nurse in conversation about. Well, yesterday I was asking you about, about the people. What's, what, what's in the picture? What is in the picture? Two women. Uh, two women. Two women. There are two women. Uh -huh. And what's going on with the, the, with the women? They are washing, they are washing the clothes. The clothes. Uh, they are washing their clothes. Uh -huh. And what do you see? What do you think is the situation? What women is angry? Is angry? Uh, what is the color? One lady. Car. This lady seems to be angry, right? Angry, yes. And another uh, one is a car. It seems to be scared. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit scared. Okay. Now, what are they wearing? What are they? What are they wearing? Okay. What are they wearing? Okay. What is this? Scared. Scared. Um. Blouse. 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 What about high this one? High heels. Uh, ah, then we have high heels. 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 And this lady is boots. wearing boots. boots. Okay, very good. Now, okay, good. Now, let us pay attention to the, to the conversation. And well, yesterday, I think you, you are very familiarized with it. Let us see. Wow. If you have a partner with... Hi, everyone. In this class, you will learn the colors and you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real conversation. Let's start by looking at the image on the screen and listening to the colors. You should listen and repeat. White. 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 Brown. Brown. White. Brown. White. Brown. Black. 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 Yellow, 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 green, 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 dark green, dark green, dark green, light blue, 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 dark blue, dark blue, purple, purple, and purple. to listen and repeat to a conversation which illustrates how colors are used to describe clothing. Let's listen and repeat. Yeah. Great, our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? Okay, I will choose only one person from the group, okay? Only one. Let me see. Uh, Rebecca, please, read the first part. Yes. Great, our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? <laughs> okay, great, our clothes are dry. Where's my new blouse? Okay, now listen next part. What color is it? Okay, now let me see. Ingrid, please go ahead with next part. What color is this? Okay, what color is it? Thank you. Next part. It's white. Jennifer Paola? It's white. It's white. Pretty good. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? Lorena? Ay, teacher, perdón, por donde van? Okay, so here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? Ah, no, it's not my white. No, I mean you need to you need to repeat this part. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? 
you. It's not my why it is mini. It's a disaster. Okay. Okay. It's all right. Okay. So we will continue. Pay attention, please. No, it's not mine. Uh huh. Wait. It is mine. It's a disaster. Okay. Karen Beatriz. Mm. Oh no. All our clothes are light blue. No, I mean this part. This part. Please. Oh, sorry, sorry. No, it is not my why. It is my. It is a disaster. It is a disaster. disaster. All right. Oh no. All our clothes are light blue. Oh, that's cool. that's cool. hey. Henry, that's go cool. ahead, Henry Vladimir. <laughs> Oh no, I all clothes are light blue. Thank you. Here's the problem. It's these new blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Griselda? He he's the problem. Is this new? Blue jeans. Who jeans are they? Are they? Whose jeans are they? Thank you. And the last part. Ah, uh, they're mine. Sorry. Oh, they are mine. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you, Rebecca. Thank you. Oh, they're Rebecca mine. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's all right. Oh, they're mine. Sorry. Okay, pretty good. So what did we notice about this conversation? Well, uh, yesterday I was just telling you about, hmm, about positions, right? So for example, I have my Hi. new blouse. It's, let me see. Yours, Yours. position, my. right? Our position. Uh, it's, oh, not, it's right. not mine position, mine. right? Yeah, wait, it's mine. Yeah, position. Well, they mine. They are mine, right? So as you can see, we have just talked about different well, items, uh, different clothes, uh, and also possessive adjective and possessive pronoun. Okay, but don't worry. I told you that tomorrow we're going to start with it. Okay? So be patient. <clears throat> Paciencia que mañana vamos a ver ese tema directamente. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now, well, um, we also were talking about colors, right? And, you know, there are different colors there are different things in different colors, okay? And we're gonna go over it, okay? Yesterday I told you, okay, that talking about color seems to be very simple and actually it is simple, but there are many colors, there are many, um, there is a lot of vocabulary that we can learn through colors, right? The word color is used in the United States. The word color is used in the rest of the English countries, right? Like England, Australia, New Zealand, etc. The names of the, uh, the more common colors in English appear in the chart below. Now there is, there is, there is um, some vocabulary over here. And what color is this one? Black. 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 Tell me three things that are black. Three things that are black. Three things that are black. The TV. The, the TV, the shadow. Eyes. The, the eyes. Mm -hmm. The PC. Aunt, five. 
the PC, the laptop. Batman, mm -hmm. cell phone. Cell phone. Batman, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell me about the three things that are brown. Uh, dough. A dough, a brown dough, chocolate. A shoe. A shoe. Coffee. Table. Tables, uh, wood tables, right? Food. Food? <laughs> okay, now tell coffee. me about coffee. What about gray? <laughs> gray. Um... Cat. Gray cat? Rat. Rat. Cloth. Cloth. Car. Shoes. T-shirt. T-shirt, etc. Tell me about what things. Uh, paper. Paper. Um, no. Um, a doll. House. House. Houses that are uh, white houses. houses. The toilet. The sky. That, yeah, the toilet. The sky. All right, etc. Yellow. Yellow. Some flowers. Fla oh. Flowers. Eggs. Pineapple. Eggs. Eggs, oh, pineapples, oil. yeah, eggs, pineapple, sunset, the duck. sunset, lemon, a lemon, yeah. yeah, there are some lemons that are yellow, right? Orange, 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 yeah. orange, 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 red, <laughs> red. orange. apple, apples, apple. tomato. tomatoes, strawberry. So there is yeah. Yeah. Uh, pink. Don't tell me Barbie, right? Because you always hear you say you say <laughs> Batman. No, let's go over. Let's let think about Barbie. No, promise. <laughs> Milky shake. <laughs> Milky shake. Car. My car. Cars. Pink Panther. Pink Panther. <laughs> Miami Heat. Okay. <laughs> Miami Heat. Yeah, I hear somebody saying so. Now, nah, purple. Purple. Grapes. 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 Pineapples. <laughs> purple no. pineapples. No. It can be like that, right? No, no, I don't say Onions. That. Blueberries. Uh, onions, onions, right? Blueberries. Now, how do you say berenjena in English? Well, <laughs> I don't know. Look for it. Look for it. Eggplant. Ah, uh, now you got it, right? It's a eggplant. Okay. Now blue. Sky. The sky. The blue. Ocean. 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 Pool. Eyes. Blue eyes, all right. Blue eyes. Hey, green. My pencil. The tree. Tree. Green. 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 My green. 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 The same as with the difference between color and color, it depends on the country, right? So the majority of the people in the United States say gray with A. And the word gray with E, it is used in the rest of the English speaking countries. Thank you, Goretti. Now you learned a new word, right? Eggplant. Good. In Europa. Yeah. Now, the word are there, so this is also important. Okay, you know, the word to be, color, and we have an example. My car is blue. 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 But you have a different order. Last time I just, I just uh, told you about a different way to say the same. Color first, and we have the now, and we have the example. The blue car the blue is... Car. 
mine. Mine. Okay, possessive, possession, right? Mm. Color is now blue. Is the color, is the color from color my car. Of my now, car. it's like, like having the color as a noun, right? Yes. Now, we also have different uh, different uh, colors, uh, such as you can also talk about shades, right? Shades uh, or intensity of a color in English by using such expressions such as light or dark. We have light blue, light blue. Dark, blue. dark blue, and blue, blue. 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 Black green, 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 dark green, dark green, 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 dark green. Dark so green. Helen has dark green eyes. His light <laughs> gray hair made him look very distinguished. Her bright pink lipstick doesn't look good. Okay, etc. Right? Right. Well, now over here we have, for example, red. What do we have? Things that are in red. Strawberry. 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 No, but don't say strawberry. No. No digan strawberry, porque strong es fuerte. Okay, so strawberry. 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 Rose. Strawberry. Strawberry. Cheese, cheese, cheese don, 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 butter, butter, lemon, lemon, lemon. green, green, grass. Yes. Okay, it is not like grammar. Listen, it is not like grammar. No, no, it's a grammar. No, it's grass, grass. in English. Grass. Grammar is grammatical. Okay? Grass, Alcat. grass, lettuce, Le uh -huh. lettuce. Go and look for pronunciation of it, please. Thank you, Goretti. Hey, Goretti is live, very active in the chat. Good, Goretti. Now, how do you say this in English? I mean, pronunciation, people. English. Lechuga. Lechuga. Look for the pronunciation in the internet, please. Let us. Letters, right? Letters. 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 Okay, thank you. Catherine, Catherine is also sharing some vocabulary. We have blue, oh. sky, sky, ocean, ocean blueberry, blueberry, and whales. 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 Black, we have bats, we have bad. the night, night. But bad but not bad man, right? So tire. <laughs> Tire, fly. 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 fly, white. We have paper, paper sugar, sugar, sugar meal, 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 snow, 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 snow ship. and ship. ship. Pink, 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 pink tongue, tongue, cotton, cotton candy, cotton candy floss, brown, wood, wood red. Cigar, 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 cigar. 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 Earth. 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 Rose, breeze, breeze, grapes, grapes. What's the meaning of this word, people? Breeze, breeze, breeze. How do you say that in Spanish? 
Wow, Goretti, Modesto. you know, Goretti is very active in the in the chat. She is sharing Modesto. every single word. And now you saw, yeah, now you know, right? Breeze. Now somebody said it in Spanish there. Good. Yes. Yeah, that's right. Bryce. Excellent, Catherine. Thank you. Catherine <laughs> and Goretti are wow, taking advantage of wow. every single word. <laughs> every single word. Okay, and just to finish, because but we need we need to see something here, something else here. Now. What color is this one? Blue. Dark blue. 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 Uh, okay, so you will tell me. Let me see. Blue. 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 Now we're supposed to type how what is what is this color? Blue. 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 Green. 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 Do me the favor to do me the favor to to type the color in the chat, please. Green. Oh, thank you, Catherine. We have green on here. All right. Green. This one? Orange. 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 Red. 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 Okay, thank Red. you, Carol. Purple. Yeah. Red. Red. Pink. Pink. Thank you, Pink. Jacqueline. Thank you, Carol. Pink. Pink. Purple. 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 Pop. Purple. Black. Black. The luck. Okay. Black. Yellow. 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 Give me, give me a second. Okay. We're in the in the black color now. Yellow. 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 Gray. 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 Brown. 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 No, brown, no. brown. 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 White. 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 Yeah, white. Yeah, because if you say weight, that is a different word. Now, I don't know, but I think we are going to face some problems with gray because I remember yeah. We're supposed to type it with uh with e, but we're gonna see ninety percent. So you see, this is the problem, right? Why? Right. Because in the United States, Brown. with e, yeah, with e, right? With a, but in different countries with e. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> No okay, so ask him in Australia. Wow, that is fantastic. Well, we have just studied about this vocabulary, and well, I think you have a homework assignment. Okay, and the homework is to, uh, because tomorrow, you know, tomorrow we're gonna we're gonna study about possessives. Um, yeah, this is a topic for tomorrow, right? Possessive. So, now here, well, you need to be aware about it, okay? So, just for you to see the information that's coming. Now, for example, somebody was just telling, teacher, I, I feel like a little confused um, mm -hmm. about subject pronouns. I, you, he, she, it, we, you, they. Possessive uh, adjectives, my, your, his, her, its, are, and there. And then we have possessive pronouns, mine, yours, his, hers, its, ours, okay. and theirs. Okay, so do not worry because tomorrow we're going to work a little bit 
uh, with those exercises, okay? So be ready for tomorrow. I don't know if you have any question so far. No. No question? No. 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 Okay. So uh, for tomorrow, as I said before, we have we have Humber, right? What is the Humber, people? ¿Cuál es la tarea para mañana? Working the platform. Okay, eso, miren lo que dicen por allí. Eh, Re, repasar los posesivos. Mm -hmm. es, es sumamente importante. Yo creo que por ahí les, les compartieron un mensaje en donde le solicitaban que adelantaran mm -hmm. en claro, la plataforma, claro. ¿verdad? Que no se vayan quedando con las actividades mm -hmm. ahí pendientes. Eh, si hay este, alguna... Alguna duda, pues ya ustedes ya saben que en el grupo de WhatsApp hay compañeros que están este, por ahí mm -hmm. y les pueden, les pueden ayudar okay, a aclarar mm -hmm. cualquier situación. Um, let me see, what else? And also the, the, the other homework, la otra tarea es que, vaya, en de posesivos, vamos a hablar del possessive noun case. Ahí se lo voy a poner en el, en el, en el, en el chat. Este creo que no va a aparecer en la plataforma, pero lo necesitamos ver. De possessive noun case. Possessive adjectives and also possessive pr pronouns. Okay, por ahí alguien decía, hey, teacher, me, me confundo un poco, ok. Mm -hmm. No es ningún problema, pero no. eh, para que eso ya no nos suceda, tenemos que practicar mucho, ok. Mm -hmm. Identificar las reglas. Y um, cómo se, como se les da el uso. Y ya pues cuando lo veamos ya vamos a saber cuál es el possessive noun case, el possessive adjectives y los possessive pronouns. Sí, chef. Hello. Uh, what is uh, the other number for the possessive noun case? The possessive noun case is going to say uh, Rebecca's, the Rebecca's uh, laptop is uh, expensive. Rebecca's. Mm -hmm. Rebecca's, Jose's, Goretti's. Okay. So, but there are certain rules. Hay ciertas reglas que hay que seguir, okay? Okay. Okay, so. For, for teacher. Hello, Margarita. Uh, for, for example, uh, Sandra Salon. Sandra Salon, okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay, so well, we're gonna we're gonna finish on here. We're gonna pause the class over here, and tomorrow we we're going to see each other once again. Remember, recuérdense que este viernes vamos a recuperar la hora que, pues, lamentablemente no pudimos eh, cubrir ayer, pero el día viernes siempre vamos a tener esa esa hora, okay? Así que los veo mañana, Dios mediante. Espero que descansen. Y que sigan aprendiendo inglés. Recuerden que la, la primera pregunta de la clase es, hey, ¿qué has aprendido ahora en inglés? Eso es lo primero con lo que iniciamos siempre. Ok, so, see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. 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 Good night.